superstars, man. What happened? <laughs> okay, so he tried to take credit for all the number one recruiting class stuff. We know what your business card says. Yeah. So you kind of have a good career for yeah. the Pokes. You get back into this coaching thing, you're running the mm -hmm. club a little bit, yeah. start having kids, and you have more kids. And then yep. that's what I was just asking you about, like, <laughs> yeah. how much are you spreading yourself thin right now? So oh. talk a little bit about coming out of college and then the adjustment yeah. to where you're at now. Well, right now I enjoy the road trips. I get a little more sleep. Get sleep <laughs> in, sleep through the night, undisturbed. Um, no, I finished up with Perry 2014. We wrestled freestyle. I coached kids club a few years. And she was just my third year, I think, as a recruiting coordinator. Um, it's just kind of do, do as needed and do as I'm told. So number one recruiting class in the country. Like, I've seen some amazing yeah. recruiting classes. You guys just knocked it out of the park. Um, talk about the level of effort that went into that. I don't, anybody that doesn't recruit in college or closely related or connected to it doesn't realize the time yeah. and effort and the strategy that goes into getting one kid, let alone yeah. as many kids as y'all got this yeah. year. Well, we were fortunate. We had a lot of, a lot of relationships with our recruits through, you know, through camps or through our careers, you know, and it's a group effort. We have our full staff on board 100% of the time and, you know, just stay after it, so. Talk about coming through the Oklahoma State program and then staying a part of it. Yeah. Obviously, it had a huge impact on you as an athlete, as an individual, um, and then the person yeah. that you are now. Talk about what being able to stay a part of that. Oh, it's, I, I don't know if I could say the right words for it. It's, it's special, it's special to me, you know. it's. I met my wife in Stillwater. Um, It'd be really hard to peel us away from the program, the community. Um, we're both really invested and really rooted down in Stillwater. And I think it's a program and culture. Once, you, once you're in, you're in, you know. And we got guys out there coaching all over, and they, you know, they bleed orange, and you know, I'll bleed orange forever. So. I spoke 